Hello friends and welcome to Kitchen Storm. I am back with another video on how to make this egg biryani. First, I am going to start by preparing the eggs for the eggs masala. I am going to do the marination right now. First, add around one teaspoon of ginger garlic paste, one and a half teaspoon of red chilli powder, one teaspoon black pepper powder, one tablespoon basin flour or gram flour. and about 1 tsp of salt now mix them with your hands add a little bit of water to get all the basin from the bottom of the vessel to mix them with the eggs now my eggs with the marination are ready for the egg masala i am going to take a pan and put it on a medium flame and then add 1 tablespoon of butter Simmer your flame because you don't want the butter to burn. Now add marinated eggs into this. The reason why we are starting off with the eggs is because the eggs need to absorb the marination properly before going into the rice. Cover it with a lid and just move your pan in between a little. At this point, take the eggs off the heat and set it aside. The list of ingredients for the biryani are one and a half cups of basmati rice soaked and drained, one inch stick of cinnamon, two green cardamoms, three cloves, two medium-sized onions sliced, two teaspoon of ginger garlic paste, two medium-sized tomatoes chopped, two tablespoon of fresh coriander leaves chopped, a few mint leaves torn, one teaspoon of red chilli powder, one four teaspoon of turmeric powder. Half cup of coconut milk and salt to taste. Now for the rice, take a deep pan, add about two tablespoon of oil into it. Add the cinnamon, cardamom, and cloves and sauté for one minute. Now add the onions and sauté till they become soft. After about three four minutes of sauteing, add the ginger garlic paste. Saute this till it becomes fragrant. Now add the tomatoes and saute for another two minutes. Now add the coriander and the mint leaves to this and saute for another two minutes. Now add the red chilli powder and the turmeric powder to this. Sauté for a few seconds. Add the half cup of coconut milk to this. Add two and a half cups of water. Also add salt to this. When the water comes to a boil, add the rice. Add about one teaspoon of ghee to this, and mix well. Now cover. and cook over high heat for 5 minutes meanwhile on another smaller pan take about 2 tablespoon of oil and add one medium sized sliced onions to this after adding the sliced onions add a little bit of sugar on top of them to caramelize them this will enhance the onion flavor Meanwhile, lower the flame for your biryani and cook it on a low flame for 10 minutes. After the onions reach this stage, take them off the heat. Now, remove the lid. 
you can see that the biryani has cooked very well in this time and it smells amazing mix the biryani in your kadai so that the onions and tomatoes and all the spices are mixed well you can see that it is very very hot right now and i'm going to transfer this into another dish after transferring the biryani add the fried onions on top because of the caramelization the onions are stuck together so you can just separate them if you are in a hurry to eat your biryani don't refrain yourself from just cooking the rice and just adding boiled eggs on top i have sliced the eggs into half there you go guys the egg biryani is ready all the ingredients list for this recipe are mentioned in the description box below for more such recipes do like share comment and subscribe bye